catfish people, what's up? Hey, y'all see where I'm at? Yes, indeedy. Hey, we're supposed to meet some people down here, but the weather's been being so bad. I stopped off at the river. We decided we weren't going to hit it tonight because the wind and the rain and everything. Uh, so I decided to stop at the river. It's just unfishable. I said, you know what? Heck with it. I'm going to come on down here. I'm at the spot where I caught my PB at, y'all, two years ago. Same month, just a couple of days prior. I got five rods in the water. Two ugly sticks, a 10-foot and a 7-foot. I got the mad cat and the two-bay cat fever, medium heavy. I'm running live cut bait on everything. If I catch one, I'll show you the rigs. We got the pin pursuit three six thousands, pin pursuit three eight thousands, and the pin fierce six thousand and pin fierce eight thousand. Running thirty pound Berkeley trialene on everything, fifty pound test uh, leader line on everything. Water is choppy. I mean choppy, choppy. Now let me show you what. This is a big shout out to Epic Catfish. I'm running some donkey baits tonight, y'all. This old big daddy mad cat rod, the 10 footer. It gotta have a big bait. Look at that big old head on that thing right there. Good Lord. Donkey bait, y'all. That, that, uh, you know, I don't throw the heads away when I catch my crappy. I keep them heads. So. We're going to cast this big old thing out there. Let me pause this, finish getting set up, and we'll be back, hopefully, when we got a fish on. Fish on, y'all. Oh, yeah, baby. Big cat fever ride. We just got to get in now. Oh, that thing's pulling drag, y'all. Fight here, baby. Please tell me we got all that on film. Woo! <laughs> oh man, let me get some more light. Woo. Oh man. We just oh Lord, we just got us a monster. Oh man.
Oh, Jesus, y'all. Whoo! Y'all seen that fight, didn't you? Oh, man. Let me get this off. Give me some gloves on here. Ah, get my measuring tape out. I ain't got no scales, y'all. Y'all know I don't weigh them no more. Oh. I'll get the fish here for y'all in just a second. Y'all bear with me. Big Cat Fever Rod. Fancy rig with the rattler. Ben Fierce, three, uh, Ben Fierce, three, 6,000. 30 pound test Berkeley Trilene. Hey, y'all. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Look at this beast, y'all. Woo! Oh, my Lord. Look at the mouth on this thing. Ah! Let's lay him down here. Whew. Let me get my tape measure here. Let's get a girth and a length on this bad boy. Forty-seven, forty-seven, forty-seven and a half. Uh. Oh man, he's still baby. By thirty-five and a quarter. Nice catch. Man. Tell oh, me. Let me get a rag with him and get some of this mud off of it. Ah, be still, brother. Whoo! Ah! I'm gonna pause this, y'all, and take a picture. All right, y'all, I got me a picture. Let's get this back in the water, y'all. I'm gonna uh, see if we can't get here. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Calm down, baby. Beauty. That's what it's all about, y'all. Let me pause this and get cleaned up. Another one, y'all. Bad cat this time. I ain't even got the other one casting out yet.
Typ. There you go, right? Two piece chicken nugget with fries. Ah. Ah. Let me get some more light. Number two for the night, y'all. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, let me pause this, get a picture. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. Two to the bank. Ah. So I'll see this again. Woo! Mad cat. Let's get this one back in the water. Two. Hey, we blessed tonight. I got. Oh man, I got. I got to catch my breath, y'all. I was putting the other one back in the water. Came back up. I paused and said, "I'm gonna get it baited back up." As soon as I hit the pause button, the mad cat rod went down. Let's pause this and see if we can't get them back out in the water. All right, y'all. Now that I calmed down a little bit. The first one was caught off of the Big Cat Fever Rod with a Pen Fierce 6000, Pen Fierce 3 6000, 30 pound Berkeley Trilene, running a uh, 50 pound test mono leader with the uh, Santee rig with the rattlers on it uh, and a 12 volt hook. The, and that's a 7 foot medium Big Cat Fever. With the uh, EV EVA horn, ah! so excited, y'all! With the EVA handle, the other one was caught on the Mad Cat rod, and it is running a straight. Um, it's running just a straight Carolina rig. They both had the big donkey baits on them. Epic donkey baits is the way to go, brother. Two big donkey bait, uh, uh, crappy heads. That's what's took down. I'm running bluegill. I'm running white perch. The, the crappy heads, that was the only two I had. I did get to save one of them. The other one is gone. Um, I heard some bales. I tell you what, the water is so choppy. The camera's crooked, y'all. Sorry about that. The water is so choppy. Windy. Oh, my God, it's so windy. But, hey, we came down here. We brought y'all two to the bank. I said I was going to leave at 10. 9.30, I think. 9.30, 9.40 right now. I'm, I got them all casted back out. All five rods. Well, actually, I reeled in the, the, the seven foot. Um, so excited, y'all. I get so emotional and so excited when I catch in big fish like that because it just, I do this for y'all. Bring y'all these bank spots, show y'all the gear I use, and I back it up with bringing y'all big fish. I hope that's enough proof for y'all. Oh, um, Dan River, baby. It rocks. The ugly stick uh, big water rod, I reeled it in. Um, because uh, I had a three ounce egg weight on it, and it, it just kept rolling it right up on the bank line. So I said, you know what, I'm going to reel it in. Plus, I, my bail broke off. I stepped on it. it and it's broke, so I needed the bell. It's the only one I had left, so I said, you know what? I'll reel that one in, and this is the backup now. So I'm running the four rods. Um, and I got them staggered. I got the 10 foot, big, uh, the 10 foot, uh, ugly stick catfish special, the big orange one. I got it casted out to that deep, deep hole sitting right beside it. I've got the uh, big cat fever core candle, and it's just casted straight out, and the other two are just casted straight out. Where I'm fishing at out from me is about a, excuse me, it's about a 25, 30 foot hole right there. 
They call it a soup bowl or something. I don't know. But that's what I've been told. I try to dump my baits in there. I have been successful year in and year out dumping my baits in that big soup bowl. Let's hope we can bring y'all another one. One more thing, y'all. Reason why I didn't do a measurement on the second one, the belly was so swole out on it. I didn't want to take no chance her having eggs. I wanted to get her, get a picture, and get her back in the water as fast as I could so she can get them eggs out of it because her belly was just swole. So we got her back in the water and she swam on off good. Well, y'all, two years ago, 2022, I was down here on Bugs Island. I got my PB, blue. Let's fast forward. That was on the 10th of this month. Uh, April. It was April the 10th, 2022. Fast forward. April the 12th. Well, let's rewind. April the 12th, 2023, I was fishing the river, and I pulled uh, four nice blues to the bank down around the uh, Angler Park area. Now, here we are this year on the 12th again. And uh, I think I just broke my PB again, y'all. When I get home, I do the measurements on it. And I know that's not 100% accurate. But my PB was accurate. It was a 63. Um, so when we get back, we'll do the measurements on this. Well, I'll do the adding it up and see. And we'll get an estimate on it. But it was a beautiful fish. It was caught. Took a picture and released. The other one, tell you what, that was a fight too, y'all. This must be my month. Hey, this is my first trip also in the spring. I went some in the wintertime, didn't do much. They caught some small channel cats, but that's it. Been doing some crappy fishing and some uh, bait fishing, bluegill fishing and stuff. They've been doing pretty good. I don't really make videos on that though. I need to start though. Y'all got any tips or pointers or things y'all want to see? Hey, just shoot it in the comments, and I'll do my best. I make these videos for y'all, I tell you, so that you can get down here and hit these bank spots the way I hit them. I try my best to put y'all on the best spots that I possibly can so y'all can rip monsters like that right there to the bank. Hey, we're going to sit back, watch these rods a little bit more, and see what happens, and we might pack it up and go on home. I don't know. We're going to give it just a little bit longer, y'all. Well, y'all, you know what? I ain't gonna be greedy. We came down here, we cast it out around about six o'clock, brought two to the bank. It just now hit 10 o'clock. We gonna reel all this in and make this long journey on back home. Thank all y'all for tuning in, watching my videos. And again, tight lines, God bless. To the next one.